don't think I can get those running any better. And what? We're all the way down here. Okay, so we're gonna end up starting where the dead person died. That could turn to be my turn out to be mildly inconvenient. But for now, desk lamp. Desk lamp. Indeed. And she's already encountered our uh, friend, Mr. Jigo. And his golden freaking shotgun. game call that? Yeah, it just calls it a mannequin. Fridge. What's in the fridge? A blender. Because that's where you keep your blenders, in the fridge. Hmm. You've seen this already? Time is passing. So we gotta hurry. Close the door. Now we can turn on the blender. We need to. I didn't realize why the first time I played this. But we need to also turn on the fan. Come on. And we need to jump into the flag and wait for this to, this to do its work. Now if you see the fan, we'll blow the end of the string into the blender and the blender will wind it up. So we just got ourselves a free lift. still passing. Now, what can we do from here? There's a bicycle. We've got a bicycle. There's our past influence. Bicycle has a bell on it, so let's ring the bell. That's because we keep distracting you. But she still has an assassin after her. And to get some time back. But that's bad news. Now we go. We can lower the switch. What does it do? Let's find out. Hello, Mr. Wrecking Ball. Nope, didn't hear anything. La di da di da. Don't look up. Now, let's open up this ladder. And now we've got a one way trip into Mr. Wrecking Ball. And we can open this thing that happens to be holding the wrecking ball.
Bye bye, Jigo. It's all right, girl. You can relax now. Mr. Danger is gone. Yes. We saved our first life. Now we return to the present. Very slowly. Alrighty. It's raining. And poor Miss Little Lady is stuck here in the rain. Bless it. truth begins to dawn on us. He can't recall anything. Great. What is this place? Most importantly of all, I assume, why were we killed? Random pieces of ice are falling off the house. Yay! It isn't, Mr. Desk Lamp. Ray. All right, Ray. No, not yet. We have an excuse, though. We don't know. Others never do. I suppose not. Whoa, to disappear. Well, that's not good. Yes. And who might that be? Really? Who? Good point. So we can't use our powers on our own corpses. So we can't save ourselves. But we can save other people. I guess there isn't. We still want answers. Correct, sir. As well, we should, yes. Very carefully. Ah, oh, with Little Miss being rained on.
As soon as we regain our memory. Alright. Alright, good. Now we can actually save whenever we want. Thank you, sir. Now we have to get the mislin, so let's shimmy along this wire here. And look, umbrella. Hopefully. Ah, uh, yes. Now we can reach Miss. Now we can reach her. Oh my goodness! No, I don't think you do, hon. Sorry. Take this umbrella and go for a walk. Goodbye, cat. Alright. That was interesting. Uh-huh. There's a note here. Let's see if we can read it. Go ahead. Importantly, telephone. on the phone. <clears throat> Easy. For Jigo. I remember that. I thought it was his boss. Wait, so does that mean... talking to her, buddy. Yes, I accidentally dial dialed this payphone in the middle of nowhere. Trace complete?
Yes. Very much so. And that would be over phone lines. Ah. Uh -uh. Powers have grown weak. Ooh. Sorry to hear that. Ask for my help. Alright then. truth about yourself. So the two tasks are, tasks are one and the same? So if we find out about our own murder, we'll encounter these mysteries that Ray wants us to solve. Well, that's handy. Indeed. We have a junkyard phone number, so we can come back here. And now, this. Let's go! We've seen how bad this scene runs. Very bad. No matter. Our story's only gonna last for one night. We have to find some answers before the sun comes up. Finally, we can save. I shall not, for I shall end this video. Next time, we shall pick up where he left off in Chapter 2.